everybody else to have these. You guys sound like Christmas today, yeah? Uh, yeah. Well, you know what? I mean, it was a... Uh, 6 k is a service animal. So yeah. I'm going to boil them in the kettle. I'm like, why have I never thought to do that? Why? I feel like I can probably go down to a size four. Oh my gosh, these are so comfortable. Good morning, I am currently in Munich, Germany. I just wanted to start off this vlog uh, with my nine days of travel. I don't think my schedule is going to change, but I go to Munich and then I go to Amsterdam and then I go to London. I'm filming different vlogs right now, so I have a lot of stuff going on. So um, I very well could be uh, in this room for the next uh, Q&A video that you see but so that's what's happening right now but I do want to give you guys a room tour I also want to say thank you all uh, for subscribing to my channel and the support and if you don't mind hitting the subscribe button in the description box I would really appreciate the support so let's get into this um, room hotel room tour uh, this hotel um, in Munich is by far uh, my favorite hotel. It is Restoration Hardware Vibes is all that I have to say. So just to give you a little tour so you guys can see. This is the entry ray and over here you have where uh, so it's, it's like an open closet. You also have a closet inside here. My robe, slippers, and I have storage here. This is the closet here. And the bathroom, my favorite, it's super modern. Tiled throughout. You have this glass window here that opens up and you can see into the bedroom uh, where the bed is. Sink, toilet, and the shower and the shower is my favorite because it's an on and off button and you can control the temperature by just a tap of a button so if you want it hot you just tap it up and then it shows the degrees on there and if you want it cold cooler you just tap the cool button down it's so cute all right come here all my crap is here look at this floor to ceiling windows tv over here bed over here cutesy cutesy look at this super modern sleek right i love it and i love the curtains they kiss the floor just how i like and then come over here to the bed look how cute look how cute swing back over here that's about it. This is where the kettle. Uh, there used to be like a full like glass mini bar last time I was here. I guess I don't do that anymore. Hmm. And I'm going to need to use that kettle for later on. Um, when we landed... I stopped by the grocery store. There's a grocery store inside the airport and I picked up some eggs. So it's like, you know, I've been flying for four years and um, one of my colleagues picked up eggs. And I was like, what are you going to do with those raw eggs? And he was like, I'm going to boil them in the kettle. I'm like, why have I never thought to do that? why i told him i was like i'm gonna put this on youtube and i am gonna tell everybody uh where i got the idea from so i am going to debrief as i like to say and i'm going to take a nap i'm going to dinner at five o'clock and that should be it for the vlog <laughs> been seven minutes of rambling you probably have skipped this part already if you haven't skipped this part put a upside down smile emoji in the comment section below
phase probably around I think 12:30. So uh, really an un uneventful trip in Munich apart from going to dinner. But um, I didn't, I wasn't able to film the video that I needed to film. So hopefully I'll be able to film it when I um, land. So we'll see how that goes. And I will sign off. I'll leave the vlog here. Uh, I mean, I'm working no part today in economy. So um, when it comes to like German speaker chips, the German speakers work at the top of the bar card. 36K is a service animal. So yeah, I will end the vlog here. And I'll see you guys in Amsterdam. That's the next trip. So it's 7.30 and we just got to Amsterdam. I'm exhausted. <laughs> and hopefully the ride to the hotel won't be long because today is Sunday. And I will check back in with you guys once we get downstairs. We used to never go this way. It used to be a different way. It used to be a different way. Remember we used to have to walk like really, really far. on the gate. Oh. It's just been a long time since I've been here because we never used to go this way. Oh my gosh, because you know, we usually come into the cruise center. Now we go. Wow, okay. So nice. Can I close this door? It's going to close by itself. It's going to close by itself, she said. Thank you. I think I'm trying to catch a cold. Do you have any cold medicine with you? <laughs> Say hello to YouTube. Yeah. Say good morning. Okay. Say good morning. Yes, you are. No. I was gonna, no, well, I have I actually. Hey guys, so I made it to my hotel room and I know I look crazy, my hair is pulled back in this clip right now. So I'm currently fighting a cold, like I don't feel sick, but my nose is like running and stuffed up. So I'm gonna take a Sudafed 12 hour and I'm gonna try and pass out but the crew wants to meet up at 5.30 for dinner, so I am not sure if I'm going to make it or not. But let me give you a, a quick tour of my hotel room. Um, it was a short six hour, 40 minute flight. And it's like 3 a.m. back home right now. So this is the bed over here. This is the funky room. Um, some of the rooms in this hotel don't look like this. Some of them are huge. They're open floor plan and they don't have this ugly carpet. It's actually wood floor um, in some of the other rooms. But this is definitely orange 1950s carpet. There's a bed there. Like I said, there is a full window. Uh, floor to ceiling windows here. You have a vanity. TV. Um, then you hit this corner here. <laughs> you have a mirror here and a ironing board and iron there. You have an open closet here, extra storage. I have my luggage here for now. I wonder. Oh, this is just the safe. And then 
the bathroom, it's not terrible. Believe it or not, there are worse hotels than this, but it's clean here. And then the shower. The tub is huge, but yeah, very European for sure. So I am going to debrief and I'm going to take some Sudafed and try and like get rid of whatever the hell is going on up through here. And I'll see you guys after I wake up from my nap. I did not meet the crew at 5.30 for dinner because I just needed to rest. And yeah, I just feel like crap. Um, I've taken some 12 hour Sudafed and hopefully uh, it brings me back to life really. Um, yeah, I just feel like my head is like draining and the seasons are changing and I'm going back and forth between like hot and cold and so I'm getting hit hard and I'm trying to catch it before it gets uh, any worse with the color of my noses. Whatever's going on, I'm fighting it because I cannot afford to be sick. I have to work and I have things to do and I have people I need to see and I just cannot be feeling like this this is terrible and I haven't been sick for so long but when I do get sick it like takes me down so there's been a lot of things that I keep saying that are gonna happen that haven't happened <laughs> um, I just remember that I was in bed I was like I did not show you guys how I boiled the eggs in the kettle pot and I realized I didn't even take my camera with me when I went out to Munich to go eat. I had to use my um, phone camera. So I'm just slacking. Super slacking. This cannot be any indication of how uh, Vlogmas is going to go. Uh, whether I'm doing anything or not. Whether or not the vlog is two minutes or two hours. I'm going to have to pick up my camera and record every day for... Uh, vlogmas so i'm just ranting i will see you guys um maybe in the morning maybe back in jersey because this has been a total of nine days of travel uh series that i'm doing so yeah i'm gonna i don't know get my life together and i will see you guys later hey guys sorry Fixing my hair. I'm not gonna touch it. I am in London. We are a little bit late. It is 12.05, which means it is 8.05 in New York right now. And I am exhausted. The flight time was six hours and 30 minutes, and we did not get crew rest. I am spoiled. I need crew rest, okay? So I am feeling a little bit better. I'm in Amsterdam. I was down and out. Uh, and yeah, so I still feel and probably sound like congested and nasally uh, because what is, whatever is happening to me, it's happening like right here. Definitely ear, nose, and throat. It was throat. I don't feel it in my throat anymore. My ears are popping, but it's okay. Because um, I've been taking 12 hours Sudafed every 12 hours. Like, it's my business. Like, it's my freaking job. But I do feel better. I have a second wind. Uh, hopefully, I pass out here soon. I may meet two of the boys from the crew at 5 o'clock to the mall. Uh, Westfield Mall is literally two blocks around the corner from the hotel and it's huge it literally has everything that you want in there from low end to highland high, highland from low end to high end to high street um this is the proper terminology there's charlotte tilbury in there there's jimmy true louis vuitton there's gucci there's primark there's john lewis it is the mall of dreams and it's my mall of dreams and i should not be going in there the only reason why I need to go towards that direction is because there's a waitress shopping grocery store. A waitress grocery store. That's the only reason why I need to go over there. But the mall is attached to the waitress grocery store. Do you know what I mean? 
And I'm a terrible window shopper. I can never just like, oh, let me just go window shopping. No, I probably will end up buying at least one or two things, even though I would like some new sweaters. We'll see. But I'm definitely going to go to the mall. And I'm definitely going to take you guys with me. And I'm definitely not going to stay in my hotel room like I did in Amsterdam. Okay? I have to get out. And I have to fight whatever it is trying to take. Super tiny. Got my pouches here. Dumped out all my crap from my long trunk bag that's here. Uh, bed. Queen size. I've already sat down upon it. Come over here. The TV here can't really quite see can you let's see a little hallway light there for you uh this closet here safe a little closet no robe all slippers these slippers are from munich <laughs> little mini fridge here there's usually nothing in there if you want to go grocery shopping keep all your cold stuff cold some direct drawers here and the bathroom. This bathroom, usually the bathroom does not look like this. I don't know if this is a remodel or what. I think I've only been to like London twice this summer. But yeah, it looks a lot better. It usually does not look like this. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. They have done some remodel. No complaints, but look how close. Look how tiny this bathroom is. Look at that. Like I keep saying, I'm going to take a nap. I'll see you guys at the Westfield Mall or at Waitrose or wherever my little heart decides to take me to when I wake up from my nap. Bye. <laughs> hey guys, so I just woke up from my nap. I got ready. It is 5.24. It's so funny, the hotel clock is four minutes faster, five minutes faster. It's probably the clock that I need to be using in the morning when I get ready so um okay so yeah I just got ready um I'm gonna grab my bag and my wallet and I'm gonna go eat something first at the mall and then uh, I'll probably walk around and hopefully do some window shopping hopefully do some window shopping and um then go to the grocery store so I can have food for tomorrow's flight because on this trip I didn't pack my lunchbox because the, the liquid restrictions again you guys already know this the restrictions are so strict and if I have the slightest bit of honey or ketchup which they have pulled out of my bag before it's like it has to be in a liquids bag so sometimes I don't even bother I can't even have yogurt that's over 70 grams and all yogurt and majority of the in the grocery stores that's over 100 mil so <sighs> no yogurt no liquid products uh for tomorrow's flight so all whole foods it's completely black outside at 5 30 at night which is crazy to me let's go ahead and get going <sighs> This is why I don't wear tin coats. We look ridiculous. For me, anyway. Zara has self checkout. <laughs> okay, guys, so these are the. Oh, I'm in Lulu Women right now. And I think I have found the best pair of leggings I have ever tried on. These are the Align two thirds, size six. 
so, it feels like I have nothing on. Let's see if I can get. I feel like I can probably go down to a size four. Oh my gosh, these are so comfortable. So these are navy blue. I'm gonna try on this, and then I got a black pair I'm gonna try on as well. One of the guy with me too. I don't want, I don't want anybody else to have these. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are like Christmas today, yeah? Uh, yeah. Christmas day. Well, you know what? I mean, it was uh, it rain today. It's like, that's me, that's actually the same. Shut them in your bag. <laughs> <laughs>